that fast. One's going like that. This is not loud enough. Okay, so when I have so I have four clock signals going in from an SCM shuffling clock multiplier, and then I have three of the outputs being used. One's doing pitch. One's doing opening, and closing a gate on a board, and one's doing a um, changing the wave folding on an antios. So, and I'm just using an antios board and SCM and the matrix we see. So, simple patch. Um, so, turn this up. Love it. The idea is you can get like step sequence patterns. You know, just by running clocks into it and adjust the levels of each one. And then maybe I'll play a game. Yeah, you can get that ring mod, like sideband frequency things, and you run like two kilohertz sound into it, and kind of tapers, like, it goes off full range audio, but kind of tapers off around, starts to decrease around three kilohertz or so, it rolls off. Um, you still hear it all up to 20 kilohertz, though, so. Um, okay, major PCA. So the other one's the pingable envelope generator, and um, what it does is it solves the problem of making envelopes that are timed to a clock. Exactly. Not just starting on the clock, but actually starting and stopping within a timing, time frame that you set by a clock. Versus every other envelope generator that I know about, at least all of them in Europe, they're timed by um, a trigger and a reset pulse often, but the actual time of the envelope is, is CV or knob control only, which is super useful and like, don't get rid of those. But you, if to, to time something to like a clock, which um, I have a lot of clocks in my system, you need, you, you can't do it exactly. So, so that's what this solves. Um, I wonder how I'm gonna patch this. Um, so basically like, if I have a clock here, um, let's make something go, something go. It's like that. Here, I could. I 
could um, So the clock's about that rate. You can multiply that clock just right on board with a knob, which is CV controlled. So that's like times four, times five, times six, seven, eight, or divide it. You know, so you can rotate so your clock, you, right? You're sending a clock to it and you're multiplying it or dividing it, is that what you're saying? Exactly, instantaneously without right. rotating. Okay. In our, like, you don't have to rotate the RCD or SCM, you, you can just rotate that input. Um, it's scalable, so it's negative to zero, positive to net to zero. It's a bipolar mode too, okay. All the same stuff, skew, triangles, different curve shapes. And this is all CV controllable, so like, So now I'm, with the, other, with the other channel, it's two channels, with the other channel I'm... You know, speeding up and slowing down the envelope with another envelope, blah blah blah. So, okay, the really cool thing it does is really weird, but when you clock it at audio rates, directly. So there's no other and then and it's just clock in, output out. So, yeah, so envelope generators to make noise. Now you don't stop asking me questions about it because I saw it. Okay, don't ask me questions. I love talking about this. 